Warning, video contains extremely graphic and disturbing images, which may offend some viewers. This creation is strongly advised. Thank you. What's going on, Screaming Eagles? This is Jet Eagle 101 here. Welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5 Series SX Edition. In our last video, we were raiding the FIB building to delete some files of past crimes that we just did, and we went to go meet up with Dave, and well, it didn't go very well as we planned it, and everything. And if you're wondering why our screen is like this right now, I was recording earlier and I didn't realize that my microphone was not working until I fixed it so right now I'm trying to do the best I can right now because we're replaying the missions that we did in that last video so I hope you don't mind but this won't be too bad but if I just gotta say if you like the game so far hit that like button if you got something to say about it hit it down in the comment section want to be part of the screaming eagles for more exclusive content hit that subscribe button and hit the bell notification for more upcoming videos by jetty go 101 now let us go in let's see here and this is lamar's down Going on oh, here. hey. Hey. What you doing here? I mean, I'm real glad you're here. Come here. Come I can't on. stay. What's up, babe? But it's Lamar. What that fool want now? It's your best friend. He's your best fucking friend. Mm -hmm. For real. My best friend. My homeboy, right? My nigga. Man, fuck you. I mean, not like that, man. But no, he ain't. He just another nigga from the hood. Him stretching all the motherfucking clowns. All he want to do is drag a motherfucker down and live in the past. And this is the future? A big empty house with nobody who gives a fuck about you. Well, shit, it works for me. It can work for you, babe. I'm getting married, Franklin, to a doctor, not a murderer. Then what mm -hmm. the fuck you doing here, Tanisha? I'm worried about Lamar. You got to help him, Franklin. Man, that shit is old. Oh, I'm a legitimate businessman now, sister. I'm a CEO, an investor. I'm a Illuminati. I'm a fucking moron, nigga. You a phony fuck. What? I ain't saying you got to marry the fool. I'm saying he's about to get killed over that deal you and him put on with... Stretcher set him up. Mm -hmm. Fuck, man, my whole fucking life I've been looking after this motherfucker and paying a price afterwards. Fuck. Oh, yeah. Well, at least do it one more time, Franklin, for me. For you? For you and your doctor? I love you and Lamar. We grew up together, but this life ain't for me, and you knew that. You ain't changing. I don't care how many cars you own, how many apartments you own, I don't care how many diamonds you put in your ear. It ain't for me, not done bad or done good. All right. Hey, look, I'll change. No, you won't, and that's fair enough, but at least respect what you do, who you are. If you let that idiot die, you a bigger asshole than I thought. Look, he's going up to some sawmill near Polito Bay. Ugh, All you right. do what you gotta do. All right. Let's go to the sawmill then. I wonder if I get my car in the garage. Let's see if I can. Nope. I don't. Guess I'm taking this car. Franklin, what's up? Hey, man. I'm in a bit of a bad situation. My boy Lamar got set up. I think he up near Polito Bay at some sawmill with some ball. Could you like mm. do some computer magic and look into it? Is that possible at all? It should be. I've got a back door into the Polito Bay police network left over from the score we did up there. Uh, give me a second here. Uh, hold on. Uh, uh, yes. So what it say? Huh. Uh, this must be it. Uh, there are older reports of a weed operation being run by an African-American gang. Uh, the files got buried, so uh, I'm guessing they paid off the cops. Mm -hmm. They grow weed up there? Growing it in the hills, most likely, but they might be packing and shipping it out of this sawmill. I'd expect a fair few of them up there. Shit. And I'm gonna need some help. Can you tell Mike and Trevor to meet me up there? They still aren't getting along that well. Tell him it's for me, and it's serious. Thanks, man. All right. Turn that off. Turn that radio off. I don't need to hear, hear that while I'm trying to drive right now. Besides, I like to talk instead of listen to music. That's how I roll.
Alright, so a long way to go. We gotta go save the mark and get himself in trouble again. Ah, oh, darn it, I busted my bumper again. Man, why doesn't that go easy for me when I drive these cars? Uh, guess it is what it is. Ah, I broke the windshield too. Whoa! I had my red Turismo, but I lost it. I can't believe I lost it. Ah! That was a close one. So close. Ah! Watch out for those guys. Yeah, watch out for them. Oh, go, go. Whoa, whoa. Here we go. We're up high now. Huh. No, now we're talking. Air jump. Hey, 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 why'd you invite this stoolie, huh? We want Lamar to be rescued, not sold to the feds. Give it a rest, asswipe. Man, what y'all mm -hmm. two shut the fuck up? Now let's take a look at this place, man. Lester said this was some type of big weed store spot. Is it? This place is crawling with ballas, you know? Now me and you, we don't mind the old gang warfare, but suede bucks over there. <laughs> <laughs> the said bite me. Man, I said shut up. Now I see the weed, but where the fuck is Lamar? Oh shit, there you go. You know, tell Trevor I'm gonna be up on this hill with my rifle. I don't want to be anywhere around him when he fucks this whole thing up. Classic, classic, huh? He's already planning his escape. Oh, fuck. All right. He runs away from the fight, I run towards it. Mm-hmm. Well, Trevor, you just do what you gotta do. Yep. I saw a few possible entry points when I got here. One, the front entrance on the right there. It's the most direct way in and most likely the heaviest. Right. I'm meeting them head on. Direct us. Alt. Hey, I'm gonna get in position. Hey, I got a good vantage. I'll see what I can do up here when the time comes. I reckon our best shot is coming at him from two different directions. All right, I'll take that on board. You're gonna you hit him hard up front. I don't blame you. Let's go find the dude. All right. Down fire. Lamar's waiting, brother. Come on. Yeah, it's all good. Mama. No, no, no. Shit, oh. it's Lamar's homie. Where's the tall dude? Shoot him. You're head dead. You're dead. Everybody's dying with a headshot. Ah, ah, uh. LG, where you at? You got a friend of ours. There we go. Where's my homie at? Lord, under. 
I got him, I got him. Give us the mouthy one, and we'll be gone! Mm -hmm. Sniper fire! I got him. I got one of them at least. Ah, there you are. Oh, you went down. Ah. Shot. We got him, we got him. Hey, there's LD! Hey, Lamar, it's me. We getting out of here, dog. Come on. Fancy seeing you here, motherfucker. Yeah, huge coincidence, huh? Come on, man. There's more of them coming. A lot more. Move it, guys, come on! Yeah. Don't fuck with the ball, it's baby! Yo, yo. We go out They pack the a down here, homie. Yeah. Crazy dude here, too. Hey, Trevor! All right, Lamar, let's go! We're getting out of here! I can't believe your ass ain't got fucked yet. Believe it and be happy, homie. The day ain't good. If we go this way, we'll have Michael's gun for support. We got it. We all good. Oh! There's another dude in the bushes. Hey, homie. Maybe the problem is Tanisha want to get with me, homie. That's why you down here, nigga. Nigga, not want you dead don't mean she want to get with your ass. <laughs> Maybe you should want me dead. You know? Switch. I'm working on it. Here. Don't think I owe you because you turned up to this shit. Nigga, I don't think shit. I'm doing this for my own peace of mind. I'm gonna take Lamar. Hey, I'm heading out. Bye, thanks. Is we ever gonna get a proper introduction, dog? <laughs> Time to take you back home there, Lamar. Let's go back in the right car for this one. Shit, homie. You alright? I'm straight, homie. Bitches got to jump on me, though. Come on, let's let's do this in the right car. How they get you to come all the way out here? Man, I ain't finna let a little drive stand in the way of a money making opportunity. Or get killed, opportunity. Man, you always a pessimist. Nah, nigga, a realist. Because in reality, mm -hmm. all them fools want to clap your ass. Man, what a trust that dog. I peeped out that wood chopping place when we was up this way on that Devin Weston car lit, which I still ain't been paid for, incidentally. All secluded and shit. Stretch hit me up, I'm like, yeah, that's the perfect place to buy Kush by the biz ain't. Oh, Make a geez. perfect place to clap some fool you beefing with. Man, I ain't even know at the time. I just thought we was gonna parlay. Parlay? Nigga, please. Every time you leave the house, fools try to clap you. Every meet you set up, homies there for the express purpose of clapping your ass. Man, you show, sure? Cause I'm sure this been a few times. No, I'm completely a fuck. No, I'm completely a hundred percent sure. Every time, nigga, whether you buying drugs, selling drugs, or discussing drugs, talking about the weather, whatever. Man, these streets is hard, dog. This the hood you talking about. Maybe you forgot since you've been uh bettering yourself, <laughs> sitting in that house on the hill, looking down on the animals in South Central and shit. Man, you know it ain't like that. Do I, my nigga? Because that's the way it looks to me. I'm making the best out of what I'm giving. You know what I'm talking about? I ain't in some type of mentorship program. The only mentor I got... Then we gonna do something about that, dog. Trust me. Man, I ain't got people teaching me that white-collar crime shit. Ain't shit changed for me, and you ain't helping. Ain't helping? What the fuck you calling it? <laughs> me, Michael, Trevor, we all came up here to help. The unholy fucking trinity. Ballers beware when these fools rolling together. Oh, yes. You jealous of Michael and Trevor? What happened to me? Hey, you fucking shit up. Four gangsters, nigga. So I shouldn't have called him, right? Man, I was... Ah, there we go. I'm going to take my problem and make sure you wasn't clapped. 
I can make sure I ain't clap. Clearly you can't. Next time, homie, don't come. And matter of fact, if you do come, don't bring them, dude. All Man, right. Look, let's not talk next time. Next time, don't get your ass in the situation, all right? It's the hood, Frank. That's what happens in the hood. You know the fuck it don't. Not for everyone. I'm one of them dudes that it happens to. Uh huh. Man, you Definitely. gonna tell me what was going on back there? Hood shit, homie. That's the shit that's different from the country club shit your overpaid ass is presently accustomed to. Mm. Man, stress put us on this shit, man. Man, we gonna get on his ass. Homie! Man, we gonna get on his ass. Man, fuck that, homie. Look like I give a shit. Nigga, I give a shit. Stress do what he do. Niggas want me dead, be dead themselves. I ain't gonna overreact to shit. Overreact? Man, that nigga stress tried to get you killed, nigga. Nigga, that's the hood. I'm still here, ain't I? Just. You show sure stress knew they was gonna book me? Yeah, nigga, stress knew. Everybody knew stress knew. Tanisha yep. knew stress knew, and she don't even come around the fucking hood no more. Damn, that nigga stress janky like that? Man, you don't see this? Miss Stress been screwing us from the start. Like from back in the day? From like the other day, dawg. Since after we went to the recycling place and D and them ballers try to take us down. Uh. Was Stretch put in the work on? Hey, yeah, man, that's the vibe. Remember how angry his ass got? Especially with you bringing him. Damn, Stretch Woof. You bringing them into this shit? Aight, aight, but tell me this, though. If Stretch was fucking with your boy LD, why he set us up with the deal for the brick in the first place? Mm -hmm. He go off and make peace with the ballers, come back, and then put us on the lick on Grove Street. Man, you remember Grove Street? That brick was drunk. I walk. Yep. Ripping us off was probably Stretch's ideal anyway. Damn, you think so? It makes sense, don't it? Man, I ain't knowing, man, baby. Man, Stretch got in with the ballers when he was inside. Played us as Mark's dog, but a bunch of them got booked. Now they, gotta... now they gotta come back at us. So stress sends you out there where they doing a cush deal. Then you show up and save the day. Yeah, thankfully. Man, it wouldn't even be the same if your boy LD wasn't out here getting in the shit. And FC wasn't getting him out of it. <laughs> nigga. Oof. So I guess, I guess what we learned is, nigga don't think it ain't no fun if you had fucking with the homies, nigga. You feel me, my nigga? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess you can look at it like that. Hey, but on some real shit, my nigga, uh, you know your nigga out here doing BAD, man. Why don't you slide me a few dollars or something? You know what I'm talking about? It's hard out here in the city. Oh, shit, my nigga, that's nothing. Shit, yeah. nigga, I know you done went all Illuminati and shit, you know what I'm saying? Leaving the street niggas in the back, but... Damn, man, uh, way to keep a nigga down, my nigga. I mean, thank you, I guess. It's payment for all the work a nigga put in for you getting them cars and shit, you know what I'm talking about? Give a nigga just enough money to get him a... Little 40 ounce in the bucket of chicken on the way to the pole house, huh? Man, don't be what? like that, dawg. Cause number one, I never got paid for them motherfucking cars. Number two, I saved your motherfucking ass. Oh, no yeah. matter how many times you and that tiny motherfucking brain of yours to try to get us killed, I saved you, dawg. How you supposed to, my nigga? I thought we was homies for life. Me too, but I thought we was trying to get out of this bullshit. You live in a fantasy, homie. The mm -hmm. best thing you can hope for is a big turn off of your motherfucking funeral. Nigga, ain't nobody coming to your funeral. What? Man, what about all the motherfucking times I saved your life, homie? What about that? Oh, thank you, homie. Thanks for leaving your nigga in the backfield. You know what, my nigga? If your ass can just act civilized, you would get some work. But instead, you want to be this game-banging mad dog and asshole. Oh, my bad, Mr. Gold Card. Excuse me, sir. Thank you for helping out a post street nigga like me, sir. You can go now, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nigga, who you think I am, nigga? Fuck you, Lamar. Nah, fuck you, F, nigga. I thought we was homies, nigga. But that's some shit that just got past you, my nigga. Mm-hmm. You know what, dawg? If something good comes up, I hit my dude, man. Chill out, all right? Yeah, whatever, nigga. You just hit me when you find out what the true concept of friendship is, nigga. We came from the sandbox together. I know that. I got you, dog. If something good come up, I got you. Yeah, whatever, nigga. I'm in a turf, nigga, if you remember what that is. Uh-huh. Oh! What's up, playa? Hello, Franklin. Man, I don't know y'all. We done, Hey, man. we ain't done yet, homie. Not yet. Nearly. Man, what the fuck y'all want me to do? Kill mm -hmm. the president? Fuck his wife or something? Or invade some fucking country? No, no. Something more sensible. Something that's gotta be done. Hey. When the timing's right, you're gonna take old Trevor and put him out the pasture, homie. Michael will be sensible, but Trevor... Trevor won't be. Trevor is a liability that none of us can afford. Man, Trevor saved really? you. He saved both y'all asses. And it's unfortunate. Hey, when we give you the word, you're gonna do this thing. Uh-uh, I'm not gonna do it. 
I don't know what Make you're talking Michael about. To do. Me and Trevor cool, dog. Michael can't do it. Trevor won't let him near. That's why it's up to you, homie. Hey, who is that? Nobody. Don't worry about it, nigga. Hey. Lost an ass, nigga. Ay, ay, ay. Well, how, how do we do? 50 bucks. Bar down. Mission time. Uh, the mission time is always something. The accuracy was 100%. Well, how do you like that? Alright, that's Michael now. Let's go change into a tuxedo and look like a pro. There we go. The producer does not drive himself to the premiere. Come on! All right, all right, all right. The Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. Open that champagne, Jimbo. All right. Me and the big dog getting our drink on. Hey, hey, where you going with that? Woo! My dad's a movie I'm producer. Just, you know, keeping it real. What about you? <laughs> Jimmy, get back down here. Which makes me a movie producer's kid. Jeez, Jimmy. Jimmy! I'm gonna ride out the next two recessions without ever having to work. And I'm gonna get a sports car and a drug habit before appearing on Reality Rehab Show. And then I'm gonna sell my story and become really judgmental. And <laughs> I'm gonna use all the contacts I make in treatment programs to become a producer too. Oh, and really? I'm gonna make even shittier movies than my dad does. Cause I don't care about movies like him. For me, it's just an opportunity thing. Woo! Yeah! You see the streets edge losers? Chisel in the movie bizzo. Hear that fine wood? You hear that fine wood? Hey, I hear it, and I don't like it. We're going to the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. Get back down here. And not to, like, gawk at celebrities from behind the barrier. We're actually, like, properly invited. Yep. That's how we are. Jimmy getting drunk right there. B to the I to the B. Jimmy. Read my necros. Entitled. E. N. T. Uh, title, cause I am Jimmy. Oh, pop, chill. I'm done spraying this shizzle. Let's take a drink. Okay. Jimmy, shut up a second. Ooh. Hey, Devin. Look, I need to say about Molly, man. I'm sorry, but I didn't do it. I told you to slow it down, slick. It was an accident. I was there, but I had nothing to do with it. Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah, hey, you made a fool out of me, Michael, and that is something I'm not going to forget. Look, Devin, I said I'm sorry. I feel bad for you, but you don't threaten me, because this movie's happening, all right? So let's just calm down and try to be friends again. Oh, absolutely, Slick. Forgive and forget. Namaste. Oh, jeez, he sounds mad. Hey, we're here. Holes in. To the red carpet. Good you know, to go. I'm really proud of you, even though you did make a pretty shitty movie. Well, thank you, Jim. Where are the girls? Uh, they're at home. You know, they'll uh, express their pride by showing up really late. Uh, of course they will. <laughs> Thanks, Antonio. Give me nice and tight. Hey, it's Laszlo on the red carpet of Meltdown. Some big stars, some beautiful dresses. We're gonna see some side boot tonight. Come on. Mm -hmm. We did it! Salma! We fucking did it! Fucking A! <laughs> Fuck you, fate! I may be a lecherous old has-been, but I'm a has-been with a premiere at the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. I see <laughs> nice. Hey, thanks. Enjoy the picture, everyone! Mr. Richards! Mr. Richards, hi. If I could just bother you for a second. Um, I'm Laszlo from uh, Famer Shame. Um, but I do some acting on the side. I was wondering if... Uh... Oh, yeah, of course. You should come see me, kid. I think I got a project that would be perfect for you. Oh, that's fantastic. It's called The Closet. Really modern stuff. <laughs> Pervert. <laughs> come on. No, 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 no. Let's go over She's here. lying, okay? I never had surgery. Come on. Milton, Milton, hi. Sorry to bother you. Quick question. Get in here tight. Um, 
love, love, loved the movie. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. When, when you were that polar bear and you had to eat your baby, I mean, that okay. was... Okay. All right, Jesus Christ. That was emotional. Stick and I just have a hug. Oh. That really affected me. All oh, right, all right. Thank you so much. Sheesh. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come on. Come on, let's get in there. Ah, Laszlo. Oh, shit. Come on, shit dick. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell is she? Looks like she stood you up. Hey! <laughs> hope I'm not too late. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Devin, the fuck are you doing here? Hey, what a movie, huh? Meltdown. Congratulations, Mikey. We did it. Hey, let's get a picture, huh? You, me, the proud producer. Such a pleasure working with you. You see? Oh, yeah. I was here. Unlike your wife. Seems to be stuck at home. <laughs> Oh, what? You twisted fuck! You're a dead man! Mm-hmm. Let's go, Jim. Come on! Hold on! Where's Mom and Tracy? Come on! The girls might be in trouble at the house! Hey, hey, hey! Full throttle away! What happened? I don't know. This rich asshole's pissed off at me because I didn't shit-can the movie. And then his lawyer died, and, and he just told me he's gonna hurt your mom. You killed his lawyer? And now he's gonna kill mom and Tracy? He ain't gonna do anything if I gotta no. say it. But you fucking killed his lawyer? No, I didn't. It was an accident. Ah. I would never do anything to put you in danger. Shit. All right. Okay. You'll be fine. You're tough. This is just a movie guy, right? He's not a gangster or anything. No, he's not a gangster. He's just... Extremely rich. He says he's got all these connections. All right. Hey, Jimmy, you gotta hide. I'm gonna find the girl. Oh, good. Ah, what I gotcha. With Tracy, we gotta get in there, Michael. Okay. He's in there with our girl. Mom, Dad, help! Help me, Dad, help! Gotcha. Oh, help. 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 Stay here. Keep your heads down. Be safe, baby. Don't you worry about me. Clear the building! No! What? Yeah, get <laughs> that, <laughs> motherfucker! Ah, it! Not yet! Stay put! Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Are you happy now? Ah. I got you. Headshot. Trace! Amanda! I th <sighs> oh. Oh. Got you, Ouch. Chick. Oh, uh, we'll all right. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh. Hey, what, was that? what happened? Someone there? Oh. What's going on here? <laughs> Fuck. Oh. 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 <laughs> yeah, you like that, don't you, huh? Take it off. <laughs> oh. Get Ooh. the fuck off me. Uh, I, I thought I was on that guy. Oh. So you sit on his face? It's called teabagging? Mm -hmm. I really fucked him up good, though, huh? Yes, you did. I'm gonna make a call. It's all gonna be okay. Stay put. Oh, jeez. Wow. How did we do? Ah, mission time. Ah. They came to my house, Lester. My house. So I asked Amanda and the kids to move out for a few days. I hate to say it, but Meriwether isn't short on excuses to come and kill you. Where's Devin Weston? 
I ain't looking for perspective, Lester. They came after my family. All right, all right. I, I don't know what to say. Does this change where you stand on the Union Depository? Hell no. We move on that right away. Before it gets any hotter. That's smart. Uh, meet me at the strip joint. I'll get word to Frank and Trevor. All right. So, we're going to end the video from right here. I hope you enjoy it. If you did, hit that like button. If you got something to say about it, hit it down in the comment section. Want to be part of the Screaming Eagles and more exclusive content? Hit that subscribe button and hit the bell notification for more upcoming videos by Jet Eagle 101 And as always, I'll see you later. Have a good one. Michael! Did you find them? Who? The person who sent the mercenaries to our house! I'm working on it. Are we safe? You said we would be safe. He's not gonna try that again. I'm on top of this, Amanda. Trust me. Really? You're sure? I'm positive. Look, I love you, baby. I'm gonna take care of this. Okay. Have a good one.